gosh, you know what the Lord spoke to me? He said, this is your best season yet. And I'm going to do it through your relaxation. And I'm going to do it through your rest. I was just sitting up here meditating on his goodness. And just how awesome he is. And just reminiscing on the greenery outside along with the beautiful skies, the sunlight. Just really availing myself to him and just admiring all his beautiful creations. And the Holy Spirit is saying that's the very same way I'm going to get that creativity out of you through is through your wrist and through your relaxation. I was like, God, you are just so awesomely amazing. You are just so awesomely amazing. He's wanting you to know that he is pouring in. And he is pouring out of your mouth of all that was deposited in you through your wrist and your relaxation. He was like, I've got you laying in this bed so I can get exactly what it is today, right now. That I need you to get out so I can see my people through. So I can pull my people through. So I can move my people through. And you got to do it. Through rest and relaxation. I was like, wow. Because you can hear me. Clearly. When you've availed yourself to me, you can hear me speak to you and you'll be able to identify with the sound. If you're attentive to that nature, if you're attentive to my beautiful creations, if you're attentive to what I've done for the whole wide world to see, This is what's going to bring the deposit forth. It's where you rest and relax and you reside in me. So me laying in this bed is not by coincidence. It is not by an accident. It is by the choice of Jesus. He's going to do things the way he wants to, how he wants to, and when he wants to. And he is saying re rest and relaxation is the way I want the Holy Spirit to move right now. My way today. For this moment. For this time. And God is saying even through that rest and relaxation, you're still going to shine. The dying hour has come. You will still hear what thus saith the Lord and hear what the Holy Spirit is saying through rest and relaxation. Because your mind is will be relaxed. Your heart will be more receptive. You'll have more of the capacity to receive. What it is that I am saying to you, you will know definitively and clearly that that is me that is speaking to you, that that is no one else that is speaking to you. And your right now faith is the very thing that's making a way. Hebrews 11 and 1, now faith, it is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things that are not seen. And it's, he says it's going to be your patterns. It's going to be your patterns. That I am changing through this rest and relaxation. It's going to be more of the oil. It's going to be more of the anointing. I am pouring in for you to pour out. The Lord is saying there is an abundance of rain through your rest and relaxation. And you know, Holy Spirit is so amazing. He's, he's saying, and I want to prove to you, it's going to be rest and relaxation of you bringing my word forth effortlessly. And he's using me as that representation to let you know 
you can be resting in relaxation right relaxation right through in your bed and still be feeding people through the Holy Spirit and God said you're going to do it expo expeditiously exponentially <laughs> You're going to do it exponentially. You're going to do it freely. And you're going to do it through rest and relaxation because of me. Y'all excuse that. <laughs> rest and relaxation effortlessly. And you see how my laugh has changed. God said I'm changing and rearranging things. Through rest and relaxation. God is even saying, get some rest. He talking to me too, you guys. He is talking to me too, you guys. Did you hear what I'm saying? He's talking to me. I'm doing what he said. I'm being obedient. I'm walking in obedience so I can eat the good of the land and the land of the living. God said he's going to do this thing effortlessly. He's going to do this thing through rest and relaxation because you'll be able to have a sound mind. It'll, you'll be consciously, conscientiously clear. God, you give me these words, but you got the Holy Spirit. Help me get the words out to your people through this rest and relaxation effortlessly. God is making ways. He's making ways and God is doing a totally different thing. He's changing and rearranging this thing from a totally different level and from a totally different perspective of what, not what you're expecting. Cause you, as you can see, look at me, I'm, I'm resting through relaxation and God is still changing this thing. And he's re doing it through rest and relaxation. And he's doing this thing effortlessly. And once again, he said he is in control and he can do it how he wants to do when he wants to do it and where he wants to do it at the time and the season that he's want to do it. And he's doing that thing through rest and relaxation. If you will absorb, let these rhema words permeate, flow, and saturate in your spirit. I'm telling you, God is going to do something magnificent. Magnificently spectacular. Do you hear what I am saying? He's going to use you and cause you to walk into a phenomenal faith move through rest and relaxation. He said he's going to do this thing effortlessly. He's rewarding you effortlessly through rest and relaxation. Do you hear what I am saying? I understand that God is in the plan. And Romans 8 and 28, all things work together for the good of them that love God and to those who are called according to his purpose. When you are called according to his purpose and you're doing things with a purpose, for a purpose, and on purpose and allowing the Lord to use you, God said he's going to do it effortlessly. He's even going to use your hands. He placed, he's placing the oil of your anoint, the anointing on your hands. He's using the work of your hands. I even hear he's placing more of the oil of the anointing in, on your lips, in your mouth, upon your head. And he's pouring these things in while you are resting in relaxation. Through re relaxation and rest. Is where he's bringing out his best. Avail yourself to him so you can hear what does save the spirit of the Lord. You can hear what the Holy Spirit is saying. And he's doing a different thing from a different level, from a totally different perspective. The way he wants to do it, how he wants to do it. For his glory. You got to remember that it's not about you. It's about him first. 
Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things are being added unto you. And he's providing that righteousness through rest and relaxation. Through risk and relaxation in the mighty name of Jesus. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. God is releasing you. Check out the previous videos. He is releasing you. He is doing that thing now. He is pouring in now. And he is pouring it in. You're going to be doing it effortlessly. You're going to be doing it through risk and relaxation. The Lord said he's going to even do it in your sleep. He's going to do it in your sleep. He's going to bless you in your sleep. And he's going to bless you through rest and relaxation in the mighty name of Jesus. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And don't forget to hit that noti bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video, you guys. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word of rest and relaxation has opened up your creative juices, your creative ideas, your witty inventions, and caused you to be able to think, wait a minute. God is doing a different thing. God is bringing about change and rearranging it. God is doing this thing effortlessly, and God is doing this thing through rest and relaxation. Because God has something better for you, and he will. See you through. All you got to do is continue being in alignment, decent and in order with the assignment and availing yourself to him, knowing that he has beautiful creations and you are his beautiful creation. And he has placed a deposit in you and he's going to get it through, through rest and relaxation in the mighty name of Jesus. I love each and every one of you guys. I'm constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. Like, share and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Don't forget to check out Revealing the True You Life Trials and Triumphs at Amazon.com. It is available right now, you guys. Life Trials and Revealing the True You Life Trials and Triumphs. In the mighty name of Jesus, you're going to get what you need effortlessly through rest and relaxation. Avail yourself to him. Have that intimate conversation with him. Have that one-on-one -on -one talk with him. Be all he created you to be. Don't be more concerned about what other people are saying and what other people see. God see you in a different light. God see you in a different sight. God hears your heart and he knows your heart of hearts. Be like David. Men and women after God's own heart. And know that he is blessing you effortlessly through rest and relaxation in the mighty name of Jesus. Until the next one, we will definitely talk soon. God is on a roll today via the Holy Spirit, and I'm rolling with him. In the mighty name of Jesus, take care. We will talk soon. <laughs> Many blessings to each and every one of you. Bye-bye. Love you. Bye-bye.